everybody, Sergeant here. I'm back again to show you some good tricks and skill jumps on the map Overgrowth. Shout out to Tanzer on YouTube for letting us know what map you wanted to see next. Uh, be sure to comment below to let us know what map you want to see for the next video. So we're going to start off here down in bottom mid. And there's some jumps that you can do with this truck here. And we just wanted to show you a few that you can get at from this side. Uh, getting to top mid, you can jump right on the windshield and it'll allow you to get up top here. And from here, if you want to go across to the middle, you can come back down onto the upside down truck and use the tire to jump onto the sign across and then to the window. The key here is to not use your thrust, so you can use it once you get in the window. Now going back across, you want to use a sprint jump and a thrust while you're midair to get over to the other window. And same thing going back across, just clamber when you get to that window you know be sure to use that clamber and watch out for the tree on the left and the pillar on the right because they will knock you out and you'll miss that jump across so from there we'll go up to the knoll here and you'll want to focus on being close to this pipe if you want to get up into this window it's a tough skill jump um, you kind of need to crouch jump and clamber when you go up to it i tried it a few times as you'll see in the picture in the top right i sped it up uh, I tried it a bunch of times to get it the first time, and uh, once I did, you know, I saw I got it back back there. And you'll see these two blue awnings here. You can't clamber on them. It's a little bit of a challenge. Um, but if you can master that crouch jump in there, it'll definitely give you a nice route out of that, that uh, knoll section. So as we come back over here, you'll notice that there's kind of this, a few exposed spots here. And if you want to take advantage of the enemy team, you can clamber up onto this little kind of garage door piece. And you have a few different areas that you can kind of take advantage of them. You can ground pound, you can, you know, look through the tree. Uh, you know, a little cool spot that you can take advantage of the enemy team. So now as we come over to these glass panels, they, you know, they're definitely key pieces from Plaza. Uh, you're able to clamber up on them from these benches here. You'll look across, there's another set there. You can get up from there as well. You're going to want to aim at the corner of this panel and then jump and clamber up onto it. I mean, that's all there is to it. There's nothing much here. Um, you're going to have to crouch underneath that bar. But what you can do is, you know, you get a height advantage. You get out of the way of grenades. You have the angle to that green hallway and down into the middle. And really, you're just kind of taking the enemy by surprise. They're not going to expect you to be up higher. So now as we go into the next room on Plaza, you'll remember that on the left here, there was an awning that you could clamber up onto. We covered it in our Plaza jump video. And that, that awning lets you get out of the way of grenades. Obviously, it's been destroyed now, but we have these little light posts here, luckily, that you can get up on. And so we'll have one here, one over here, uh, one in the mid further down, and one on the left. Uh, some of these you can't clamber up onto, like this first one, and I've had trouble with it. I've even had trouble with this one. Um, I had to come at it from a few different angles. I got it from this side. You really do have to aim for just the edge of that light post, but again, it gives you a little height advantage for anyone coming from this direction, or if you're trying to, you know, get somewhere quick up high. Uh, this is not going to work from the front, uh, but you can definitely clamber up from the sides, and you can take them by surprise with the ground pound, or, um, you know, just stay up there and get out of the way of grenades. Uh, again, it's easier to get up from the side. Um, i just show you here another time real quick. Just jump, clamber, and you're up. You don't have to thrust, you don't have to hover, you don't have to do anything special for that one. Uh, once you figure out the right angles, it's pretty easy. So we'll hit um, another one here, going to middle. So from here, there's many reasons why you might be in this position coming from railgun or um, you're running around the corner. You want to get up into top mid, and this window is really the convenient way to go. But to be unexpected and to get your enemy off guard, you want to aim for this little nub and a bounce off it. You can thrust. You might be able to make that angle jump without thrusting, but it's key um, to hit that little bump out there and kind of kind of jump off of it a little bit and then get into the window. You know, it's a little thing, but it'll give you the leg up on the enemy team. They won't be expecting you to come through that window, potentially. And one last one here. It's kind of cool. If you're over in this green room here, you have obviously this window and this other window to get you to top mid. Um, or you're overlooking railgun, overlooking bottom mid. All you want to do is aim for this far corner here. There's like a little lighter leaf type thing. It's kind of like a concrete block, but you want to aim for it. Thrust, jump thrust, and then clamber up onto it, and that's it. Um, so those were my those were my jumps. I appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you so much for taking the time. Leave a comment below for the video that you want to see next, and we'll tee up another video for you. Thanks for tuning in, guys.
point I get the sprint boost. There you go. And then once you're up here, you have a really good view of the map. Uh, 